Hello and welcome to another episode of Rovercraft with me, Table. So, we've had a request from Dan Dolphy Games, uh, who's one of my newest chums. Hello and welcome to being one of my favourite people in the whole damn... whole damn world? Whole wide world. <laughs> and the request has been for a Tier 7 SMG tank. Now, I've kind of fallen out of love with tanks, however, I... Uh, I feel like I've played quite a lot of tanks, so I do feel that I can uh, comment on these things quite well. So, tier 10 tank. Sorry, tier 7 tank. Now, let's go through the kit. It has times 4 tier 6 caterpillar tracks. The guns are these two on the back are tier 9s, then two tier 8s, and two tier 7s. Or are they four tier 8s? Let's just have a look. I think they might all be tier 8s. Let's just put them back on and just be sure. Uh, so this should should push me just to the edge of tier 7 it should in theory it looks like it will be the case yeah yeah so 4 tier 8s 2 tier 9s now I know it is a little undergunned so in the attrition side of things uh, the tank might not do too well if it starts losing guns however it is punching above its weight which I am more fond of doing with my SMG vehicles admittedly I would go wheeled uh, it might be preferable to go with an awful lot of tier 8 or tier 7 guns on this design um, but for personal preference I, I prefer to fight with higher higher tiered guns um, so that's the vehicle the armor now I know it looks like there's a lot of this blue tier 6 armor on here but let me assure you there is a skeleton under here like if we look underneath you can see that it's all yellow. Now there is a skeleton under here of uh, tier 7 armor and also the you see the glass here on the top now that is just a distraction the pilot is nowhere near this glass section that merely exists for people to shoot at uh, and take it away from a non-critical area. I know my tier 9 guns are a little bit near to that so if I'm to be truly smart I should do this and oh, I should move my guns out further oh, oh dear doing yeah so I should move them a little further out. Uh, ironically, I did put the tier 9 guns on here. Uh, they're a bit high up. If I'm honest, I might switch them over. Maybe if I just... Oh, I don't know now. I'm not so sure on my design. I'm going to leave it like that. So, yeah, the, the pilot seat is actually down in here under two layers, surrounded by two layers on every side, barring the bottom. Um with tier 7 armor. So that's the design, yeah. I'm quite pleased with it. It's just something I uh, put together. Um, it looks quite pretty, I, I do believe, but we don't want to... Well, I mean, prettiness is nice, but it needs to fight as well. If you can fight and be pretty, man, that's a serious com combination, don't you think? So, Dan Dolphy Games, let me just uh, show you what this is. Uh, oh, wait, anyone I know? Mm, no? Good names? Oh, I'm going to have to go with G34All. Uh, with the robot called Sneaker. Is it a sneaky? Oh, there's a little bird as well. Game of Thrones references. Does anyone know that? Little bird? What's the reference? Where in Game of Thrones and who in particular calls who? Little bird. Yep. No, no prize for whoever guesses it. Just you can be smug in the fact that you are right. So, yeah, there's my little tank. Well, it's, it's not a little tank. Well, po pocket tank. Like pocket battleships. It's a pocket tank. Um, I'm not going to worry, we've got a hover medic with us. Uh, yeah, so I have chosen the right way. So, tank treads, right? Here's, here's, the, here's the scoop. You are committed to the path that you choose to travel with, uh, with tanks. Like, you decide to go left, you're going left. Um, and you can't help that fact. You know, you can't backpedal. It's just, uh, just not possible. So, all good SMGs should immediately and ruthlessly destroy air vehicles. Any aircraft, SMG, that is your first job. The good thing is as well, with the higher tiered guns, if you do get that hit in on a fast moving target, it counts, like it stings. Now these guys haven't seen any resistance, so I'm going to have to do my duty to the team. Oh, there's one there, okay. There's two over there, they haven't taken damage. Okay, so the fight might be here. Going to have to press on. Hmm. Uh, yeah, so with tanks you're committed, you know, you're not very manoeuvrable. And also, when you, if you're in a fight um, and you uh, are committed, you, you, you can't back out. You know, you can't choose to disengage. As a tank, you don't have the option to disengage. You have the option to fight, uh, die, or, die or win. That's, that's, really, uh, that's really all you have. And I, I don't like that commitment, having to commit to a fight. Um, and also, uh, another thing was that this might have been a plasma variant of a tank. In my humble opinion, 
don't ever build a plasma tank. Uh, plasma hover, plasma buggy. Hello. Yeah, plasma hover, plasma buggy. Fantastic, but don't go, don't go plasma tank. Plasma tank is a real bad move because you're not manoeuvrable, and, and as a plasma tank, you need to pop in and out of cover. Um, like this guy, this person, plasma tank. Like, it's a bad move. Don't do plasma tank. The amount of times I've seen a plasma tank, they fired a volley at me, not got it spot on, and I flanked them. Is just, it's just, yeah. Just don't do it. Oh, there's so many targets down here. Let's get, let's get some kills in, shall we? So whatever that plasma thing is down there. Let's just uh, deal with this. Come on, let's get those hits in. You're stuck behind that pillar. But it's not going to save you. Yeah, I know you just hit me with plasma, but that's fine. Still two plasmas. Lesson to be learned about plasma bombers. They're still dangerous, even when, even when crippled. I've committed to being stuck on the ice to kill this guy now. I want I want my kill. Don't think you're going to get away. Oh, you managed to get away. Where did you go? Ah, uh, hello. There we go. There's my kill. Ah, so you can see my pilot inside. There we go. You can see how low down they are. Um, I'd like to think that that plasma was aiming high, but with plasmas you're not that precise. You just need to get near because it's blast radius. I'm still rolling. I took some plasma to the face. Still rolling. Being shot in the back by an SMG. Not concerned. And I still have most of my guns. Yeah, medic, get me back in the fight, will ya? We're gonna. We're not gonna win this match. Hello. Let's just shoot at you until this match ends, then. That is unfortunate. See, as a tank, there's no way I can drive back and uh, and win this fight. Yeah, tankies. Yep, yep, you're having some trouble, aren't you? Hmm. So that's tanks. One kill. Took on a plasma bomber. I was a bit sloppy with the bomber. And also, with the bomber, like, if you're a buggy, you can choose to, like, fire from one spot and rapidly redeploy. Uh, to quote Band of Brothers, uh, Fire and Maneuver, it's the name of the game. Yeah, it's just, I'll take it out for another spin. I'm not saying, I'm not saying SMG tank is a bad design, it's not. Um, I, I want to be uh, constructive in how I criticise it. Um, with tanks, I'll, I'll go through some benefits, let's just see if there's a funny name worthy of mention. Mm, Poppadom, yeah, by Sobby Seb. <laughs> <laughs> Sobby Seps Poppy Dom. Uh, the pros of tanks. You you have to be very unlucky to flip a tank. Very unlucky indeed. <coughs> tank tracks have the most armour of any of the movement items. So over wheels, hovers and legs, uh, tank treads have the highest. Um, yeah, so there are benefits. Uh, you can turn on the spot, which I guess can be an advantage. I don't know. Uh, the downsides are if you lose, if you lose, if I lose two on one side, I can only go back and forth. I can't turn because you need tracks on either side to turn because one goes forward, one goes backwards, and that's how you turn your vehicle. So, yeah. Oh, look at this fail bot. Or are you just waiting? Are you going to take off any moment? Maybe you haven't logged in yet. I don't know. Okay, so I have to choose. Choose or get left behind. The medics are staying with me, though. That's fine. Medics can stay. Again, first duty of an SMG is flyers. Watch them. And crush them without mercy. Very important to crush without mercy. I mean, you can crush with mercy, but it somewhat takes the fun out of it. Whoa, who are you? You are very considerate, actually, for jumping out of my way. Thank you. <laughs> now, I don't want to fight the middle. I'm not going to fight the middle. Uh, plasma bomber. That's the problem. That's who we have to deal with. Not going anywhere, guys, until we deal with that. Come on, let's get some hits in. Come on. Oh, yeah, there we go. There's a hit. 24%. I don't know if I did that. But, hello, medic. See, not being manoeuvrable, I want to ambush. Now, I'm on my own here now, so if anyone makes a... 
There's a medic up there scurrying around. Should I commit? I think I'm committing to this, guys. I think I'm committing. Come on now. What the hell? Let's just face up straight and off we go. SMG off. Looks like I'm committed to this fight. Come on, let's bring these big guns into bear. See, look at that. There we go. That's what you need your SMGs to do. You need them to go toe to toe. Come on, let's just get a clip in. It's just I just need to hit it once. Six percent. Surely you don't have a gun on there. Okay, let's go. Oh, you're long gone. Oh, did I just kill them? <laughs> nice shooting there. Okay, so there we go, tank. Went toe to toe with that poor guy who bezzed round and landed on the capture point, but you're solo. The terrain helped me, had my guns low down, big punch, 10,000 space monies. I'm going to go in again. I'm going to do it again. I want to give you an all-round an all round, uh, review of this tank vehicle. Twice now, it's got into a fight one-on-one, -on -one, uh, and twice now, it's held up. Like, it held up against the plasma bomber, although the plasma bomber was damaged, but it was still firing plasma. And they are dangerous. You know, anyone who's gone up against a crippled plasma bomber, you do need to be cautious, because if they get... Even if they're crippled and they're on the ground, if they get a lucky volley off and cripple you, then it's not really a victory, is it? Because you kill them, yeah, sure, but then then you're in trouble. So, lessons to be learned there. Mm. So, I've picked up one, two kills. Have I, did I get two kills in one match? No, one kill in each match. Haven't died. Haven't died in each match. Um, so let's try again. Let's see if I can't die this match, eh? Uh, how many medics? Oh, no medics. Bad times. See, again, as a tank. It's just bad times as a tank. They're just so slow. Oh. <laughs> so what, what should we talk about in the meantime, guys? Uh, should I go... Ah, oh, so someone's taking some damage. We don't need to talk about anything. Let's keep it, let's keep it Robocraft orientated. I think I'm going to hang here, you know? Because we don't have a medic, which means we're immediately on, on the defensive. But yet everyone goes out aggressive. See, I need to choose when to commit. See, that's a bad spot to sit, to be. Because as soon as they come down the hill. And that's a bad spot. I'm just in a bad spot. Hmm. Grubson's got the right idea. Grubson's hanging back as well. I'm not committing to this fight. Me and you, Grubson, we got this. Nice, no, oh, nice tank, Grubson. I'm guessing you're undergunned though, with that much armor, or maybe you're tier six underneath. Ah, oh, we're same, we're the same variation, same, same armor positioning. Okay, let's see if we can't deal with some of this plasma, shall we? Oh, jeez, yeah, I know I'm having trouble. Sorry, Grubson. They have a medic, we don't. I'm not fighting on this slope. Sorry guys. I'm not going down there, Grubson. I'll fire from behind and let my tier 9s do a little work, but... They're still a little bit, a little bit forward. They haven't seen us. But they are coming around on that left flank. God, tanks are so... S okay, let's start killing people. I'm not fighting from that hill, Grubson. The whole team's still alive. We don't have a medic. They do. This is... Ah. See, I was flying high after the last match, but this match, people are just coming back cr crippled. They are coming back. They're like, they're capable... Good, it's a good design if you've taken a lot of damage and you're able to get back. But they're all there. I mean, I can sit here all day if you want to try and heal through this. 
mean, it's just one of me, so... Ah, I've convinced them to move, at least. The plasma straight ahead guy. Well, maybe if I can't get the plasma, I can get... Ah, oh, there's loads of them. Yeah, this match wasn't going to go well. Look, there's only two of us, me and Gibson. And I'm going to get taken out by a plasma tank, of all things. I will say this for plasma tanks, and tanks in general. They are tough. <laughs> you know, you do get toughness. Mm. The only reason I exploded in one volley then was because I was up on top of them. It's one le layer of tier 7, um, so of course you're going to explode. You know, if you're not going to... Yeah, and the trouble is, that the more you armor underneath, the higher up you push your pilot seat. So, you just have to ask yourself, are you going to receive more fire from below, or more fire from toward, from the sides and the back? So, that's it. That's the bot. I've been Table. I hope that design is interesting to you, uh, Dan Dolphy Games. Uh, if you have any suggestions for it, by all means, uh, comment. And also, if you enjoyed this video, like, comment, and subscribe, uh, and I'll create more videos. Um, it means a lot to me, you know, so, you know, people supporting amateur YouTube content creators like myself, because I'm just some guy in a room, you know, so it means a lot, you know, so thanks is what I'm trying to say. Uh, I'll, I'll see you again soon. Uh, I've been Table. Thanks so much.